Archimedes, ancient Greece's genius mathematician and engineer, a philosopher and a man of science who made his mark on the world. Archimedes was born in Syracuse, a city-state of ancient Greece around 287 BC. He was said to have been related to the ruler of Syracuse, King Hiram II, but details of his life remain shrouded in mystery. He was educated in Alexandria, Egypt, which was then a great centre of learning and culture. The influence of the great teachers and scholars of the time was clearly evident in his work. Archimedes was a polymath. His interests and expertise spanned mathematics, physics, engineering, astronomy and more. His theories and inventions changed the world and laid the groundwork for many modern disciplines. He worked on the principles of levers, giving us the famous quote, Give me a place to stand and I shall move the earth. This theory has had a significant impact on the development of mechanics and engineering. One of his most significant inventions was the Archimedean screw, a machine for transferring water from a low-lying body of water into irrigation ditches. This invention was groundbreaking during those times and is still used in some parts of the world today. It was a testament to his ability to apply his mathematical knowledge to practical applications and it revolutionized irrigation and water management. But the genius of Archimedes was not confined to practical inventions. He contributed significantly to the field of mathematics. He worked on the areas of geometry, developing the method of exhaustion to calculate the area under the arc of a parabola, and he also worked on the approximation of PI. His work on these areas was foundational and has influenced generations of mathematicians. In addition to his inventions, Archimedes is known for his work on the principles of buoyancy and displacement. It's said that he discovered these principles while taking a bath. As he stepped into the tub, he noticed that the water level rose. He realized that the volume of the displaced water was equal to the volume of the part of his body he had submerged. Excited by his discovery, he jumped out of the bath and ran through the streets naked, shouting, Eureka! which is Greek for, I have found it. Archimedes' contributions to science and technology are immense. His works have been studied, interpreted and built upon by scholars, scientists and mathematicians for over 2,000 years. His inventions and theories have shaped the world as we know it today. His influence can be seen in everything from the way we calculate areas and volumes to the machines we use to move heavy objects. Despite his many achievements, Archimedes was a humble man. He valued knowledge and discovery above fame or fortune. He believed that the pursuit of truth was the highest calling and dedicated his life to this pursuit. His love for learning, his innovative spirit and his dedication to discovery set him apart as one of the greatest minds in history. And yet, there's a tragic end to his tale. Despite his numerous contributions, Archimedes met a tragic end during the Second Punic War when Roman soldiers invaded Syracuse. He was killed by a Roman soldier despite orders that he should not be harmed. His death marked the end of an era and a loss to the world of science and learning. Despite this, his contributions live on. His work continues to inspire and guide us. His ideas have become the foundation upon which much of our modern world is built. His inventions and theories have paved the way for countless advancements in science and technology. But most importantly, Archimedes was a man who valued curiosity and the pursuit of knowledge above everything else. His life is a testament to the power of the human mind to understand and shape the world. His inventions, theories and discoveries continue to influence our world, making him an enduring figure in the annals of human achievement.